guys welcome back to our channel this is Avery um, happy St. Patrick's Day I know St. Patrick's Day is tomorrow for you guys who are Irish um, get your jig on happy Ramadan to you guys who are fasting fasting is no easy feat so good luck to you guys um, yeah we are about to head to um, what is that Pacific Produce Pacific Produce is like an Asian supermarket we're about to get some food we're about to stock up and then we're probably gonna have a mukbang to show you guys. So stay tuned, Levon's holding the camera. Show him you. What up, y'all? <laughs> so yeah, we will see you guys um, at the supermarket. And then we're gonna just show you guys around a little bit, um, see what type of foods we have here in our hometown. Over here. So. Stainless steel steamer. Something like this. And we need a little bamboo, because where it holds. <laughs> well, like one of these bamboo here. What is that and you for? just put it in here, and then you just give me oh, sticky rice. Oh, so you put water at the bottom? Yeah. And then you put the rice in the top? Yes. And that's okay. how you cook it. You just steam it, so the rice just comes up. To make sticky rice? Yeah. So, okay. oh, is... There's, there's more over here. Is sticky rice his own thing, or do you use regular jasmine rice? No, sticky rice is its own thing. So you want something like this. Yeah. We actually need this. For ice cubes. Do we need one of these? And these little things here. Oh no. Anyways, ice cubes? these... No, we don't. We can get something much nicer. Mm -hmm. But here, put this back. So this little thing here is where you put like your sticky rice in. Just cover it up. Like after it's cooked? Yeah, it's after it's cooked. Yeah, because I saw that at your mom's house. Your mom has one of those. And that's where we were digging the sticky rice out of yeah. when we were eating it with our meals. Yeah. Okay. My apartment is becoming full Asian. Got sticky rice pots, sticky rice holders. I got jasmine rice in the cabinet. I got sweet and sour sauce, hoisin sauce all up in the cabinets. Yeah. Before I met him, guys, he had nothing, nothing at all. Not even no sauce, not even anything in his fridge, not anything in his cabinets. Yeah. And this material is bamboo? Yeah. Oh, snap. Bamboo. I was trying to see what. Bamboo, bamboo. What you gonna do? It says product of Thailand. This is like, apparently it's too big for the both of us. Well, this one's perfect. I got this one, so. But this one, this part of two of us. I was thinking about going to a, like a smaller one. But since if we're gonna have family and friends over, might as well get the big one. Lesson of the day, if you go shopping in an Asian supermarket and you are not Asian or don't know anything about the culture or combination of both, just don't go. Cause I am confused as to what any of this stuff is in here. Okay? And I would be lost. <laughs> So I'm it. just asking him like, should we get this one? Should we get that one? I don't know, but this one has this one. And now he's just like, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> like how tiny this one is. So cute. Like you know how sometimes we eat on the floor? Mm. This is what we would do. Like we put it down on the floor and we just eat around it. Mm. We put our food here. Oh, so this is like a, like a platter. Like yeah. a plate. But there's, I mean, this is the smallest one, but there's there's one that's really big. See? <laughs> See what I mean? <laughs> like, <laughs> I'd be confused. Lemongrass? Yeah. So we got lemongrass. This is what? 
we all you know we always use in our cooking lemongrass kefir lime i have never seen a banana this small look at this i've never seen bananas this small that's crazy i'm gonna go see what she thinks about these bananas what are these bananas oh yeah they're like they're kind of different kind of bananas i forgot what's it called um but they're called Thai bananas right there. Thai bananas? Well, yeah. yeah, but how does it taste? Does it taste like regular bananas? Yeah, that's a little bit more, like, a little harder texture. It's not harder, it's like medium. Like, when you have it regular bananas, it's pretty soft, but this one has a little firmer taste. I mean, firmer texture. Texture, texture. Mm. So I'm confused. How do you know which one is sticky rice? Sticky rice. So here is the glutinous rice. The glutinous rice is sweet rice versus like jasmine rice. So you want to look for sweet rice. Can what time it is? Mukbang time! <laughs> yes, no, sir. I was not expecting that. <laughs> Cooper's Hawk. We got some pasta from Cooper's Hawk. Y'all get Olive Garden. Y'all probably get Cheesecake Factory pasta. But we get Cooper's Hawk pasta. And then Levon has the spaghetti and, and meatballs. meatballs. And if, as you guys see, if we already got a little bite of that. Oh, cover your face. Cover your face. Just try to focus on your face. <laughs> it's all good. I mean, they probably won't be able to see it. It's all good. Okay, anyways, yeah. he took a bite already. He was like, I need to eat something now. Because I'm hungry. We've been out at the um, Asian supermarket for a while. Um, and then we went to Pick and Save which is a local grocery store. And here we are, finally eating. Yes. So yeah, Cooper's Hawk was, is our, is our place to, for like, sorry, I can't even talk right now. Um, when we, I can't, I'm losing ahead, my thoughts. Go ahead, um, So this is like our special occasion. So we go there, we go eat in there. It's just a very fancy place. But this time we're having it to go. And we normally don't do that. Cause it's again a special occasion when we go there. Like for example, my birthday, our anniversary. We go there today it was super packed, so I'm glad we're eating. Cool. Alright, mukbang time. <laughs> so Alright. Mushrooms. Meatballs. Meatballs. So when it comes to like spaghetti, I'm not it's kind of whatever but this is the best spaghetti ever it's like a whole new level where oh where it's like oh spaghetti is a spaghetti but them they hit on the flavor they focus on each and every little thing the noodles the sauce the not just this entree like many other entrees um, so every time I go there, this is my see, second time? Third it? time. Third time. Third time having it. And but every time we would go to sit there, like sit and eat, I'm always ordering something new. Oh I'm so sorry. You good? But yeah. Always order some something new. Oh whoa. I feel like I need a spoon here. Mmm. Mmm. And you can't have pasta without a piece of bread for some reason. Mm-hmm. I don't know. What does the bread do? Why does bread always come with pasta? Do you know why? Maybe it's a good combination. Mm-hmm. But that's just my thoughts. But do you guys know? 
Uh, I know. And this is this is just regular bread too. It's like nothing special about this bread at all. Um, we normally would get like the pretzel, the pretzel, the pretzel bread. But Amy wanted the gluten-free bread. Mm. How's it? I don't think we ever tried it. We've never tried this one. Yeah. It's chewy. Oh, kind of like sour dough. Mm-hmm. Ooh, let me try. It's okay. tough, right? Yeah, but their butter is so soft. Yeah, the butter is like super good. It's like whipped cream. Mm hmm. It's very light. What the bread or the butter? The butter. The bread too. That's some good bread. Mm hmm. It's been a very fast Saturday. Mm hmm. It has been. I felt like we just woke up. Right. Like we just woke up. We laid in bed for so long. And we didn't do anything. <laughs> we mm -hmm. just laid in bed. I think those are what weekends are about too. Because in the weekday, we're always getting up early, going to work, or doing whatever, going to school if you guys are in school. Um, but yeah, the, the weekend's just nice to relax if you can. I know some people work on the weekends um, or doing something else. But I used to be me. I used to be up at 4.30 in the morning on weekends. What was the earliest you woke up for work? Oh. Like, it's normally always the same timing. Like six or seven. You don't even wake up around six now. <laughs> what are you about? There's times, yeah, I do wake up at six. But I'm on like... To get ready for work? Not to get ready for work. Like, I wake up at six and then I mm -hmm. just lay there. Mm -hmm. Because I can't go back to sleep. Mm -hmm. And then I get ready for work. But yeah. I'm normally a, an early bird. But I like to get things ready for a day. Just my body clock. Honestly. I feel like the older I get, the more I become less of an early bird. And I just want to sleep in. That's just me. Mm -hmm. You should dip your bread in that sauce you have. Mm. I did it in here. It's really good. Let me know. Let me see. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. So they can see. Because you can see your food now, yeah. Whoops. This is a lot of pasta they gave me. I feel like it's more than. They give you more if you order out than if you order in. Yeah. We've been, no not just this place, but we've been notice noticing in a lot of places where you get more when ordering out the dining in. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, hungry. I know. I know. <laughs> so when we came in, he was like, I'm about to eat right now. He was like, I'm, I'm so hungry. I, I'm, I can't wait. I was like, no. <laughs> mm -mm. I was like, we got to wait. So he eventually agreed. Yeah. So I'm excited for later on, I guess. We're gonna, I guess, play games together. I feel like it's been a while. I'm not much of a gamer, other than Animal Crossing. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah. I used to always like play, um, like Nintendo 64 with some peeps, some peoples, peoples, some people. I mean, you used to play Super, what is that? Smash Bros? No, um, Mario Party. 
Oh yeah. But that's what we play now. Yes, in our Switch. And that's probably what we're gonna play later, is Mario Party. Mm-hmm. But, isn't there like a newer version too? Mm-mm. Not Mario Party, but it's like Mario Party something. Mm-mm. And well, the one we have is Super Mario Party, or Mario Party Superstars. Superstars. There's another one, Mario Party newer. I don't know. Maybe not. This is so good. Mm hmm. Like every bite, excuse me, but like every bite that I'm taking, I'm like serious. I'm like even drooling right now. <laughs> eating this lord okay i'm gonna get napkin this has chicken and sausage in it really mm -hmm. like the sauces and chicken oh mm -hmm. okay got it never mind i see chicken mm -hmm. and sausage i thought it was like together <laughs> that's okay I don't know if it's focusing or not. That's okay. I don't got time to make it focus. This is good. So. First meal of the day. Mm hmm. What are you gonna say? Um. Just talking about how I'm always drooling. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's not even when I'm eating, it's also when I'm talking. Because I'm thinking about food. And then when I'm talking to Avery, you just start drooling. <laughs> I start drooling, and he's like, "Why are you drooling?" I was like, "Sorry, I'm just thinking about <laughs> like whatever food was in my mind, or, or like what I'm gonna make." <laughs> mm -hmm. And he goes run and like gets like a a, a paper nap, um, paper towel or napkin <laughs> for me to wipe. <laughs> I don't know why, but it's just it just happens <laughs> that's a lot yeah so this is our first mukbang ever i don't even know how to do this mm -hmm. what do you what do you, you do you watch mukbangs what do you do during the mukbang i just watch like mostly one family but what do they do like they just talk about the food mm -hmm. they talk about their experience mm -hmm. um i don't know they just make it so like i don't know it just comes whatever whatever comes in their mind i was talking mm -hmm. oh we're doing it right <laughs> mm -hmm. but yes i probably will i probably won't eat all of this because this is a lot i don't know if it's a lot to you guys but it's a lot like just looking at it. Mm -hmm. Wait, you want to try some? Um, no thanks. I like what I have. Ooh, that looks yummy. Do you need napkin? Everything just bounces out. Mm -hmm. And I love mushrooms. Next time I'm gonna ask them to put extra mushrooms. Cause I think I, I think I ate it all. Mhm. Mm Damn. I thought they put a lot in there. Mhm. Mm it does look good though. Mhm. Mm So you making lob, larb, lob? It's lob. Yeah, I'm making, so later on for dinner, I'm making lob for the first time, which 
I'm kind of excited for it. I've been craving it. So I was like, what's the point of me going to order it when I can just make it myself? So we were out getting ingredients today. I mean, we mostly have the ingredients here, but the essentials. Um, and yeah, and I'm, I'm going to be making another dish tomorrow, which I am excited for. What is it? It's um, steam catfish, but it's over, like it's inside a banana leaf. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just yeah, like, you're looking at me. Tell them. <laughs> but it's inside a banana leaf. I grew up eating it, and it's like the best meal. Um, when my grandma was with us, she like will make it, and yeah, we will eat it with sticky rice. And it is so good. So I'm gonna be making that. It's it's so nice to like share your meal with someone. Like I mean, with share your meal with what you grew up with and sharing it with someone you love. So I'm hope, hoping that he enjoys it. Do you have to prepare the sticky rice now? Or no? I'll probably prepare it. Um, later tonight, so tonight. it can soak up mm. overnight. The water, yeah. Mm. But yeah, we always, we're mostly always getting things like out, you know, like to go to other places, like sticky rice, for example. We just go to the supermarket and get that instead of making it at home we're just like but this time we're making it but yeah i grew up with like jasmine rice sticky rice all that stuff you want to tell them about my cooking it's really good or like it's really good what is like your favorite dish the curry or the bamboo stir fry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Bamboo stir fry hits. Mm -hmm. I didn't really think you would like that. Me neither. <laughs> but it's actually really good. Dang, bro, I'm a mess. The thing about Avery is he goes through so much of paper towels every time. It's a habit. And it's like you get a roll or you get one and he like uses this like this and it's like done and he goes gets another one now open it sometimes i'm like oh my god you should you can use like all this side <laughs> it's a habit and especially when my hands are greasy and i'm already touching on something like a greasy paper towel like this one right here and i wipe my hands even though there's still room on that paper towel, I gotta go for another one. I know it's wasteful, but. So I, I'm getting kind of full. Kind of, I'm getting full. Um, I had, before we went out and do our little errand, I just like was snacking. You know, I had like two bananas. I was just snacking whatever I saw. <laughs> And two bananas. What else did I have? Nachos. Nachos or like tortilla chips with cheese. I just put cheese and just put it in the microwave. And then that, that's pretty much it. I'm done. All right. I'm done. I got energy now. Yeah, guys, thank you for joining us on this mukbang. I know, you know, we may not have talked about a lot through this video, but please understand, I was starving. No, <laughs> no, I'll say that. I was very hungry. I don't know about you, but I was super hungry. And you know, when the food is just, you know, you're, you're silent. That's how you know the food is good. That's how you know you're really hungry. Thank you guys for watching this video. Thank you guys for watching this mukbang. Thank you guys for coming along with us on this journey. Stay tuned for some more videos coming out. 
<laughs> and we'll see you guys soon. Peace.